I know you're gonna dig this. Open your feathers. Oh, you, you on the left, I don't think you have any enough. To, your plumage. Open them. Open them. Stop. What's going on, everybody? How are you doing today? So here I am back at Hollywood Forever Cemetery here in Hollywood, right off Santa Monica Boulevard. Now, I've been here many, many times on my channel. And I never get tired of coming here. I'll be back here again in a week or so, probably. And it's just gorgeous. There's so many celebrities that are buried here and so many beautiful graves. You can see some of them behind me. Just gorgeous surroundings. There's the peacocks, there's geese, Canadian geese, uh, and the cats. I love the cats. And But why I'm here today, because I, when I was here a few months ago, Burt Reynolds only had a simple little grave marker. And now he's got a, like a statue or a bust that's been unveiled and I want to go take a look and I want to show you. Now my friend Steve from Visiting Grave uh, Sites with Steve, his YouTube channel, he's one of my great close, I love Steve to death. He came out here um, I think Saturday and so we miss each other unfortunately. Uh, so you take a look at his video too because he was here, he got he show, showed the bus and everything, it's a great video. Steve is incredible what he does so make sure you check out his channel too uh, and subscribe if you're not subscribed to Steve's channel. And yeah, so we're gonna go take a look at Burr Reynolds and the cats, but first, I just pulled up right here to park and didn't even know this gentleman was buried here and I'm parked right in front of where he's uh, buried. Don Adams from Get Smart, right here. Y'all remember Get Smart, right? Pretty famous show. Now look, he's got the shoe phone. It says, uh, Don Adams, beloved husband, father, and grandfather, proudly served his country during World War II in the United States Marine Corps. Comedian, poet, philosopher, movie buff, and never late for post time. A tough but sensitive man with a sentimental heart and a passionate soul. He touched our hearts as Maxwell Smart, secret agent 86 in the 1960s classic TV series Get Smart, and filled the world with laughter that will forever be remembered. Isn't that great? Wow, look at that plaque. That's crap. I've never really seen one that's on a little post like that. And I've come he right along here so many times. Very, very interesting. Rest in peace, Don Adams. But as you can see, it's just gorgeous. And um, I did a video over there, somewhere over on that side. Madonna posed for a bunch of photos here back in the 90s. Uh, she's hugging a cross and stuff. And those are some, uh, that was a good video. I, I enjoyed doing that. So we want to check out that. I think I'll put a link below to my cemeteries uh, video. And you'll see a lot more of uh, Hollywood Forever. Chris Cornell, Anton Yelchin. I did something about Scott Weiland recently. But there's Burt right over there. Let's go take a look at Burt Reynolds' new bust as we navigate our way through. Wow, quite a difference from what I just saw a couple of months ago. Wow, look at that. So we, I, I did a little bit of a bio of Burt Reynolds. I think we all know Burt Reynolds, Cannibal Run, Smoking the Bandit. And um, Heat, right? No, uh, City Heat was another one he did. The Longest Yard. Deliverance, Gator, Burt Reynolds. Yeah, I talked a lot about his uh, life on the last video, Lonnie Anderson, Sally Field. 
think Angie Dickinson. Is he with Angie Dickinson? I'm not sure. No, maybe not. Dinah Shore. Look at that. That is incredible. But yeah, there was just a simple plaque. It's gone now. And this is, yeah. That is incredible. Look at this detailing. Burt Reynolds, February 11th, 1936 to September 6th, 2018. It's a great shot of Burt. Biggest box office star in the world in the early 80s. If we just turn right around, you see how gorgeous the surroundings are. And I think I just saw a turtle. And I know my friend Ashley, who's going to be in a video with me soon, likes the turtles. Oh, there they are on the uh, rocks there. I just saw one swimming around right here just recently. Well, not recently, like five seconds ago. I don't know where I went to. But if you look across right there, that's Anton Yelchin. Right there. The Fright Night Reboot, Star Trek, and Alpha Dog, one of my favorite films. Yeah, I'll put a link to my other videos below. A little... <laughs> it's for the turtles to get out of the water. It's great. Yeah. Johnny Ramone right through there. I have a buddy that works here, actually, Raul. And I haven't seen him for a while. I'm going to have to text him, see how he's doing. Raul, if you're watching this, what's up, my man? And one of my regular viewers, Jana, uh, she reminded me just the other day. She said, are you going to check out and show us Burt Reynolds' new bust? And I said, Jana, I forgot. What a great idea. So thank you, Jana. Thank you for reminding me. Stop it. Now, I'm an animal lover. I've said this on all my videos. Canadian geese are, I'm from Canada, we have a long history together. They've surrounded my car, they've tried to hurt me, intentionally insult me, and there's, there's history with me and Canadian geese, so I just don't like them. And I, I, I know what they're doing right now, I see, they're, they're surrounding me, I'm out, I'm out. Alright, let's go see the cats. yet. Alright, so just a short walk from over there. You can see the Canadian geese are following me. And here's where the cats hang out. And as I stated on my, one of my last videos from here, Canadian geese have now taken over kind of where the cats are. But it's not going to stop me because I brought something for the cats. They're coming over here and eating the cats' food. And this was a suggestion of Jana because I have a dog. Shady. I don't have a cat, so I was like, what can I bring cats? I know that they have, you know, cat treats and all that. And she, Jan has a few cats, and she suggested the Frisky's Party Mix. And this is Beachside Crunch. Look at that cat. He's just going crazy for it. Or he's just playing crazy. But with ocean white fish and flavors of shrimp, crab, and tuna. I'm going to try a bit. Sounds good. I like seafood. But we're going to open this and see if I can finally... And there is my favorite cat, One Eye. And it looks like he has one eye, but it's just closed. But now they're all staring at me. But I want to find One Eye. They're all looking at me because they know... Oh, this one's coming right to, towards me because they know I have got, got something. Let's see what I can do. I'm going to leave the whole bag here because what am I going to do? Carry it around? Although I do like to feed the feral cats down in Georgia and uh, down south. But I won't be down there for a while. So let's see what happens when I bring... Some treats to these cats here. So put some down there. Oh, yes. They're all, they're all, you should see this, they're all watching me. I'm far away. It's 
okay. Here. I know it seems weird to put them on a grave, but that's what everybody else does with the food here that I've seen. Yeah. Oh, he's got one that ran away. This one's looking, but he's a little sketched out by me. Now this one's a weird looking little cat. It's got quite the, well it looks kinda, I don't know, it looks like he's wearing a jacket. But here we go, I got some for you too. Here we go, let's get closer. Nope, they, nope, 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 nope. Oh, here's, here's one coming right out of you. Hey guys, hey, hey, over here. Come here, come here, come on. Yes, stretch and then come over here. Look at them, they're all, okay, they're going crazy for it now. You, I wanna give you some, you are just a little wine. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Here we go, right there, right beside, yes. Now you're getting, now you've had more than enough. Come on guys, there's some right here. This one's so, oh come on. I don't really want to throw the, throw them at the cat, it's going to startle them even more. Here we go. This guy's having his fill. Oh, you're mangy. You need some. Here. Come on. Okay, I'm just gonna drop them all at once back here on the ground so they all can have some. Behind the graves. There. That's a lot. That's a that's a big beachside crunch. I hope they all share it, but oh, <laughs> what are you doing? I see you. Come on down. Come on, come down. Look, it's Frisky's Party Mix Beachside Crunch. It's good for your body and your self-esteem. Now these guys figured it out yet? No, they're all just. Now I've kind of cornered myself. Oh boy. There's <laughs> one up there. <laughs> now, this guy keeps coming up to you. You're kind of... Oh, they're all finally eating over there. Wait, can I... Are you going to let me pet you? Are you friendly? Hi. Hi. Oh, aren't you friendly? Because I fed you the most. Aww. Yes. We'll name you Jana. How's that? Jana, from now on, whenever I come out here and we see this. I'm, I, I, Tabby? I don't know. We're going to say Jana. What are you? Sweet. Nope. Nope. Oh, penguins are coming. Uh, penguins are coming. <laughs> the, the crocodiles. What are they called? The, the velociraptors. Peacocks. Good lord. Oh, I like you. But you're crazy looking. What's wrong with you? What happened? No, 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 no. Don't come near me. No, I'm out of here. You just enjoy doing whatever it is you're going to do over here. Look at that. My god. Look at that. Feet like a chicken. Head like a dinosaur. Body like my cousin Justine. It's just really, it's a whole thing you've got going on. Wow, sorry Justine. I was, that wasn't nice. No, it's just like, it's kind of like the shape. Oh, Justine. Oh, man, well, she still owes me a lot of money. I'm never gonna get back. Peacock, come on, you get your own food. Hey buddy, can I, will you let me pet you finally? No. Where's the other one watching? Huh? He's not getting any. He's just watching. <laughs> he's, he's not getting any, but he's watching. Okay, that's not the appropriate joke to make in the cemetery. Bye, cats. See you in a, see you in a couple of days.
All right, so that was my visit to uh, Burt Reynolds' bust and the cats. If you want to see the cats, just come in straight from the entrance, make a left past the peacocks, you'll hear the squawking, and then on your left, you'll see all the cats right at that wall there. That's where they hang out. That wall goes out over to Santa Monica Boulevard. Hollywood forever. Uh, beautiful. Recipes to everybody here. Recipes, Burt Reynolds and Don Adams. And thanks for watching, and I'll be doing more uh, cemetery visits. A lot more. I love coming out and paying respects in the beautiful surroundings. Cemeteries do not scare me, do not freak me out at all, uh, like some people. And um, I think they're a place of peace. And um, just, yeah, I never get, uh, never get tired of bored. Even if there's no celebrities, I, I like to read the headstones and look up the people afterwards sometimes. And this is one of the more gorgeous cemeteries I've ever come to, and I'm going to keep coming back. All right, I got the friskies in my hand. Peace. Out. This is a lot of peacocks. That's a lot. Uh, that's a plethora. What is a plethora? That is a plethora. My God. Okay, stop. Okay, there's no need to come any closer. Oh, my God. Nature finds a way. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, I gotta drive, guys. You gotta move. Okay, now I'm boxed in. I'm boxed in. So this is how it ends. Okay. It makes sense. Okay. This makes a lot of sense. I cannot get out now. Pick it up. Pick up the pace. Good lord. Yeah, that's right. Pick it up. They're right in front of my car, like I can't move. I got 99 problems and peacocks are all 99 of them. <laughs>